Hello, and welcome back to my fourth-rate Willet Blend ripoff. Today, I'm going to be blending some stuff called Kinetic Sand. You haven't heard of it before it's stuff that's kind of like perpetually liquid sand it's pretty cool stuff it's the oils in it don't allow it to dry off you see it leaking out I'm gonna play with it a little bit first before I blend it show you how cool it is and also to add a little bit of watch time. Hey, just being honest. Look, you can see no matter how much I play with it. It's still like wet sand. It just clumps back to each other itself. But you can tell I don't script these things probably should start. <laughs> anyway, what I'm curious to see is if I put it in a blender, will it maintain its kinetic properties? Let's find out. Just watch, this will be the video that goes viral and gets me tons of views. It may actually be pretty cool. Okay. I'm going to dump the sand into the blender. The very same blender which blended crayons last time. I think I'm going to press the liquify button. Hey, it actually has a liquify button. Let down smoke. Don't breathe this. Let's see if the sand retains its kinetic properties. Hmm. Looks to be largely unchanged, except a bit dirty. Either because the blender beat it up, knocked some of the blue out of it, or from crayon dust. Most likely the latter. It's pretty much unharmed by this. In the uh, pre-YouTube censorship days, I would have jokingly suggested it's perfectly safe to do. But, you shouldn't try this at home. I shouldn't have to say that, but this is not food. You shouldn't put it in your blender. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this. And stay tuned next time for where I blend something else potentially interesting.